Good morning. I'm Christy Duffy for Smart Trend News. Today is Friday, July 16th. Here's a look at commodities on the market today. Oil is trading slightly higher in early morning trade, lifted by a weakening dollar coupled with a rise in global equity prices. Still, cautiousness remains as the Federal Reserve warned of a slowdown in U.S. growth, while worries about the robustness of China's economic engine persist. Gold is falling as its allure as a safe haven is abating. Investors are increasingly willing to put their money on riskier trades, including equities. As of early this morning, Brent crude is up by a tenth of a percent, 76.11 a barrel. Light sweet crude up two tenths of a percent, 76.77 a barrel. Natural gas up a third of a percent, $4.60 a million British thermal units. Gold is two tenths of a percent lower, $1,205 an ounce, while Silver is down half a percent, 18.27 an ounce. Copper up two tenths of a percent, three dollars two cents a pound. BP is down over one percent on the New York Stock Exchange pre-market, even though the company said that it has finally stopped the oil flow into the Gulf of Mexico nearly three months after its rig explosion. Speculation is growing that BP could saddle buyers of its assets with lawsuits regarding the environmental disaster as the number of claims rise. BP may reach an agreement to sell half of its stake in. Alaska's Pruto Bay Field to a Pashi Corporation for $10 billion to $11 billion. In the mining sector, Clyde Process Solutions secured a 1.4 million pound deal from Anglo-American to supply a complete pneumatic conveying system for its nickel operation in Brazil. Royal Gold will acquire 25% of the payable gold produced from the Mount Milligan Copper Gold Project in British Columbia from Thompson Creek Metals concurrent with the closing of Thompson Creek's proposed acquisition of Terran Metals Corporation. I'm Christy Duffy for Smart Trend News. That's a look at commodities this morning. Make sure you're subscribed to our YouTube channel, Trade the Trend, so as not to miss further updates throughout the day. You could also check our website, TradeTheTrend.com, for more headlines.